Welcome back, attractive and well-educated watchers, to a brand new episode of Brotato. Last time we left off, we uh, almost went the whole way with M Mutant, got killed by the boss at the very end, because it's the uh, the scattershot boss. This time we're going to go with Lucky, who we recently uh, won with. Won on uh, Danger Level 2. So let's go and see how he does on Danger Level 3 with his trusty thingamaboop. We're going to try to go as lucky as we can for this particular one. Baby geckos, baby elephants, literally everything that we can possibly get. Yes, good, that's what we wanted. Okay, so it's a good first wave. Immediately we get a cyber ball from a, ch a crate. That's going to help a lot. And we're also going to get a baby elephant. We will gladly pass up that second slingshot for a baby elephant. So now we have exactly everything we need to make this a killer combo. Every time we pick up a material, there is a 25% chance that it hurts somebody. And every time we kill a guy, there's a 25% chance it hurts somebody. And every time we pick up a material, there's a 75% chance it hurts somebody. So, you know... It's not that bad for now. So we just took, gladly, took a turret, and we're going to start raising our attack speed, because that's our big weakness. Fortunately, the game has decided to give us a couple more slingshots. That's going to make it a little easier, because now our slingshot level is leveled out with our wave level. So from here on out, you're going to start seeing how completely devastating the Lucky Boy combo can be, and why, if the game plays ball with you, you will absolutely dominate any wave that you can. Sadly, this is a roguelike, or a roguelike, so, you know, the game always does not, does not always play ball. Pretty decent level 3. We're gonna, um, We're gonna go for that attack speed. We're gonna get that baby gecko. That's gonna help us what's called a lot. And we're going to get our fourth slingshot. So that baby gecko will bring 20% of all dropped materials to us. And remember, of course, that 100% of the time a dropped material will hurt somebody. 25% of the time it will deal a lot of damage based off of our luck. And 75% of the time it will deal a lesser amount of damage also based off our luck. Whenever we kill somebody, 25% of the chance, chance to kill them also. And look at that. You just produce a very handy little feedback loop right away. Yes! We got a crate! This is good. Um... Okay. And raise our attack speed. Now we'll get a level 2 slingshot. And another slingshot, just to say we did. And then move on. We have all six uh, ranks and our thing done. We believe we have two levels above the wave. And we are functionally guaranteed to hurt everybody on the entire map, no matter what we do. If you die, one of your friends gets hurt. If you give us some money, one of your friends gets hurt. In strict hypothesis, if we move around enough, you just get hurt. As you can see, this kind of tactic also very quickly gets you, uh, rich? Oh, yeah. Yeah, gonna have to. Also get a little harvesting. Gonna get a range damage. A little bit of upgrading. No, we're good. Alright, we actually should have taken that bait, because at this level we probably can, with the amount of damage that we do. But it's whatever, it doesn't really matter. We are well ahead of schedule. Even just dying can hurt. Nice, a crate. It's worth it. 
Uh, yeah, we'll take some landmines. We'll also get our attack speed up. Again. We will take that Gummy Berserker. That's better. We are quite a bit ahead with our uh, bouncy game. We like slingshots a lot. The problem is that they are not a very high damage weapon by themselves. And with Lucky, they're also not a very high speed weapon. We need at least another fun-loving little... Thingy. Fun loving little baby gecko. As you can see, it's actually pretty easy to keep the map clear at these earlier levels. On a pretty strict luck based run. Nice. Okay, we tried. We will gladly take that. Uh, more attack speed. If it just gives it to us, we're gonna take that. Oh. Sorry, little buddy. No reason to think that we'll need it yet. We'll gladly take that SMG. Give ourselves a bit more DACA. Need more baby elephant. Need. Need more lucky goodness. This one's gonna be a little slow, because it's the bruiser introduction level. Nice. And we kind of like having the bruisers around, because, uh, you know, with all of these slingshots, we just bounce them all over the place and kill everybody. Pretty nice. Good wave. Take, we'll take some range. Just free range. Yeah. Uh, we have some dodge. Dodge is also nice, but... Anything. One more. Nope. Alright, that's it. This is the Gib Philosophy money level, so hopefully it will be good. This is the Gip Philosophy episode, so mostly it will be empty, actually, clearly. Four crates. Man, we love this level. Five thirty, so we got about four hundred there. We'll need that. We will need that. Uh, okay, sure. Make that better. What? Just get another SMG. And a baby gecko! Our patience paid off! It is only level 10, so we have been a bit impatient, but our patience is now paying off! 40% of all dropped materials will instantly go to us. 
And that will keep everything very clear. As we recall, we have what? Two baby monkeys? Two baby monkeys! Baby elephants, baby geckos, baby monkeys. Got a regular little animal orphanage over here. We're a caretaker, a conservationist, we tells ya. With machine guns! <laughs> yes, good. So much goodness just lying around for us. Uh, uh no. Hmm. Now. Okay, all of our all okay. Yep. Let's at least get one in the green. Move on. Oh, that was a mistake. We're going to retry that. That was actually a huge mistake. We just shouldn't have done it. But that's the price we pay for our hubris. Come on. Come on, fire again. Okay, cut. Okay, over 40, or over 50. Sure, we'll do that. This is fine. Higher knockback, butterfly, full shebang. Yes! Alright. See if the game starts playing ball. More trees. We can do better. Yeah, there we go. We have been forsaken! Brotato did us dirty. This was a really good wave three, actually. Uh, we're gonna do it because we're a glutton for punishment. <laughs> okay. Saw it coming. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, okay, one last time. Wreck. Okay, well, we got 50 there. Let's do it. And in some magic! Keep going. We always got it. Fifty-three is good enough, we'll take it. Oh, 
Okay, challenge accepted. It's all like you, Philosopher. While being lucky, are still going to catch everything on fire, and we're like, I right, dog. Let's try this out. With our slow as balls, lucky boy. Because Wand is already a slow game. Let's do it. We're we're gonna do we're gonna do the childhood combo. Magic wands and slingshots. Let's go. Watch out, it gon' hurt. Yes! Now it is going to start coming together! The feedback lock loop. No. Uh. We mean if it's just free. Hubris destroyed us. We were we were too greedy, taking things we didn't need. And in the end, that was what caused us to lose out on our baby elephant. Both times at that. We've learned nothing. And perhaps if we'd sold that repost, we would not have lost out on such hubris. That was pretty good level 6. Attack speed. Nope, that's good. Made up for it, it's fine. What are our 12 uh, three times? 12, four times, 34 damage, spreads. All right. All right, we still have time. care of all this nonsense. Sweep through, collect our spoils. Yeah, this one is, uh, this, uh, whole thing is a bit rough. We... Okay. We 
We have you now, Cyberball. The more people we kill, the better. Oh, jeez! Friend, we must warn you to be careful. This is an active fire zone. There are many dangerous things being done here. Destroyed all of them. Yes. No. Yes. Hold that thought. We'll take more trees. All right. What we really need is now more snacks and more luck. This is the give philosophy shy level, uh, uh, give the philosophy shy level money, or money level. So we will undoubtedly do quite a bit of damage. Keep the field fairly clean. Reasons that should be fairly self evident. Alright. Swing back around this way. Alright. 500. Uh. Need a little bot that slows nearby enemies is the thing. Hmm. Let's do it. Let's get the dodge. Need elemental damage. Huh. That's safe. Upgrade the wands. Uh, upgrade our slingshot. Get a tree. Oh my god, get our baby elephant. Yes, thank you so much. And then we're done. Now we are on the board. 47 damage, 25% of the time when we pick up a thing, and 50% of the time when we kill a bitch. And we numb things up from a greater distance. And more trees! Which will give us more crates! Which will give us more treasure! Which will allow us to kill him more easily, and hopefully give us some baby elephants. Die, fools and knaves! You are but delicious hunks of XP to us. Ha ha ha! Uh, nah. Yeah! Uh, yeah! Baby with a beard, son! Uh, 
Uh, just gonna stop there. We got a baby with a beard. That baby with a beard does 7 damage per shot. So not only do we have a 50% chance of doing 47 damage to anybody, but anybody who will die will automatically do... No, not you! killed us that's fine if you liked your side here today remember to like subscribe comment share go on down to our patreon via that link to link in the description pledging just one dollar a month to help support the cause join the mighty mighty ranks of all the lovely people in the credits at the end of every single episode and get your name in the game maybe not this game but definitely a game thanks a bunch for coming everybody stay safe stay inside stay healthy and of course remember to help each other bye